Have you ever wondered who keeps track of the circulating supply of Terra's Luna Classic token? Well, the Terra community might have found an answer to that question through a recent proposal, and all nodes, a new player in town, a new proposition called Change Official CS API Endpoint to All Nodes FCD suggests making all nodes an official organization within the Terra ecosystem. Why, you ask? All nodes will be tasked with hosting the endpoint and supplying accurate circulating supply data for LUNC. But what makes all nodes the best fit for this job? Uh, historically, determining LUNC's circulating supply involves subtracting unvested tokens, community pool holdings, and configured bank accounts from the overall supply. Unfortunately, this approach set LUNC apart from other native tokens made. And, uh, you know, why all nodes choose all nodes, you know, with no clear authority overseeing the calculations, anyone could potentially manipulate the data. Such unchecked alterations could negatively impact the Terra network. That's where all nodes comes in. Aim to serve as the trusted source for circulating supply data. To officially adopt all nodes, they need to upgrade to the most current FCD version and implement the accepted methodology for computing LUNC's circulating supply. Once approved, all nodes FCD API would function as the authoritative source for USTC and all other native tokens aside from Luna Classic. Um, voting matters, um, and as of now, only a small percentage of eligible voters have cast their ballots on the issue at hand. With voting closing soon, on May 19th, it remains to be seen whether the proposal will reach the required quorum of 40%. So keep your eyes peeled on the outcome. And now, here's a little humor to lighten things up. Why did the Terra developer go to the bank to deposit some smart contracts? And remember, until next time, stay informed and happy crypto spearing. And, uh, you know, I would be a minute to talking about after here and like, you know,